Greg, uh, welcome uh, to, to Bury AFC. Obviously, the, the club's latest signing to uh, cover for the, the injured uh, Jack Atkinson. Was it a bit of a, a no-brainer when you, you got the opportunity? Yeah, uh, come to help out. You know, get games as well. I think for me, just especially at this age, getting games and enjoying it. It's most important when they, you know the opportunities came up. I said why not? And obviously, I've heard a lot about the club, a lot about the fan base. Um, yeah, so it was a no-brainer. And obviously, you started the, the season uh, at Ashton United as the, the number one, and obviously Ollie Martin yep. uh, came in. Is that a bit of a, a frustrating time for yourself? Uh, it's always frustrating when you're playing, but Ollie's had great games since he's come in. So, you know, whoever's playing the best has to stay in. Um, I've always been like that. Uh, you know, to Ollie, you know, he's, he's been doing he's been doing the part for the club. Um, just been Ashton's been on the other the wrong end of the. The, the goal the goals recently but they just won today so that's a, that's a good, a good step in the right direction for them as well and obviously your first experience playing in a in a Berry AFC game I know you mentioned the the fans in your your first answer how did you how did you find it um, it was nice you know what it's nice it's always good to you know play in front of fans um, I'm sure they're gonna be louder at home as well I've seen some of the videos when they're at home going a little bit crazy so uh, it's always uh, good to be supported by you know loyal and uh, you know dedicated fans like the fans of Berry. And how many of the the squad did you know coming into today's uh, game? No, uh, no Kenny, no uh, John, no no Rowney. That's the three I knew. I played with them at the other calls and Ashton. Um, but other lads were, you know, were, were nice when I went in there. You know, nice when I went in the change room. So um, it was an easy transition. And obviously uh, the next game uh, is back in the the FA Vars uh, away at, at Sunderland. What do you do you know of the? The opponents that that Barry are going to come up against, and what your thoughts are of that game? Uh, no, I don't know the opponents, but whenever you go to the North East, you know you're going to be put up, play, you know coming up against a team that's you know hard working, dedicated, and, and they're always got good players up there. So we all we know uh, we, we can't we can't just shove on the rug. We got to we got to expect uh, it's going to be a tough tough fight on the next week, and uh, you know bring our A game. And just finally, Greg, what are your your aims for the rest of this season? I think just to you know, help out, you know, be be here, you know, try, do the best I can as well, and. Um, since I've not been playing, it's good to you know put that shirt back on and get a clean sheet. Um, so for myself, you know, get them games in, um, enjoy it, and obviously help the team stay at the top of the league and, and, and progress. Brilliant. Cheers, Greg. No worries. Cheers.